Pisces, thank you all so much for joining me here. This is going to be your daily reading for your general and love energies for the day Pisces. If you guys want to book a personal reading with me, all of the details are there in the description. Let us just begin with today's um, energy check for the day, guys. Pisces, so how's the day going to be for you guys? How's the day going to be for you, Pisces? Wow, I see here that you guys are searching for some kind of a job opportunity, some kind of a dream opportunity uh, coming right at you is what I see. Like you've been dreaming of this all along and you've been dreaming about this. You wanted to do things a certain way and today's a day that you're going to get what you've always dreamed of, what you always wanted. This is really going to take you off guard. You're just going to love it. For those of you who are single, it can be also some kind of a love offer, but pentacles usually represents something related to a job, a business. So if you guys are searching for a career, for a job, or you're searching for some kind of an opportunity, you're going to get that is what I strongly see. Let us see what is coming up for your love situation. Pisces, for your love situation, Pisces, what is coming up? Just one more shuffle, guys. Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs, Pisces, what is coming up? Okay, so uh, with the Ace of Wands in reverse, so some kind of a stability is going down in your relationship, which can mean that you you were uh, very stable when it come to this person. You were having this beautiful connection with this person. And right now, things seem a little bit non-stable. But at the same time, both of you are highly intuitive individuals. Your intuition is really high. This person's intuition is really high. You both have a, some kind of a telepathic connection, no matter even if that... Um, trust is being broken or even if that uh, what to say guys one person is not trusting the other that is a lot of doubt or something that is happening which is bringing down the ace of wands down but also the love is still kind of flushing in into your relationship because you still you both have a lot of love for each other you care for each other there is a lot of feelings for each other with the high priestess this is also a lot of secrecy here but at the same time it uh, represents intuition it represents telepathic connection very very beautiful let us see what else do we have here this love can survive its course of time guys we have the world card in reverse, which means for a few of you Pisces, it can be really hard for you to end certain cycles. And for a few of you, like you just feels like you need to end certain relationships to kind of get to the next part. Okay, so with the world card, it just means the so so. Uh, hectic for you you're just doing whatever you should maybe this can also mean your career situation something just ended and it is a start of something new with the world card coming in it's just like a rebirth starting something ending something and uh, high priest is all about intuition queen of cups uh, somebody is uh, waiting out there for you guys maybe this can be somebody who you already know this person has a lot of love for you, a lot of feelings for you. They are just waiting to get back with you. They're just waiting for you to communicate with them. This person is uh, truly in love with you that they cannot let go of you guys. Okay, This person might not be beating you regularly, but they're holding on to the things that you've given them. They are very emotionally connected to you still. The Queen of Cups represents a lot of emotions, feelings. This person is still holding on to you, Pisces, and they're not able to let go of you even if they try to let go of you. Okay, so that is the reading for you guys, Pisces, and 
I will see you guys tomorrow. Keep watching to find out what is your lucky color and lucky crystal for the day Pisces. So this is your lucky crystal pick a card reading guys. So pick any card that you feel most drawn to because below that is the crystal that will really help you with today and the color that will help you with today. So feel free, meditate for about 10 to 15 seconds, open your eyes and see what card draws the attention most and pick that card because it will resonate with you no matter what you're going through. Okay, so let us just begin with the card number one. This is the one, two and three. So for the first crystal, we have the hematite crystal. So hematite crystal is very good to balance yin yang energies in any kind of a relationship. Yin yang also called as twin flame connections. And it helps to focus on your emotions. It helps you to balance your spiritual and your physical side of yourself it also helps to let go of any kind of a negativity and to bring a lot of love and a lot of um, better experience into your relationships it helps you to get away from anything negative and start something fresh for yourself okay this also is a crystal that the uh, will heal your headache that will heal anything that is negative around you this uh, crystal is a very very magnetic crystal which is also good for intuition which is good for improving any kind of a relationship and you're kind of uh, even improving everything around you you're rooting yourselves more uh, personally and physically into certain situations and this is a beautiful crystal in case if you're facing all of this then this is a great crystal to use and the lucky color is the light blue color so if you are using light blue today things are going to be beautiful and it will have the same effect like the crystal okay so if this doesn't resonate then go ahead and choose anything from these two piles guys okay now i will be starting off with the pile number two for your lucky crystal is celestite so celestite is also one of the beautiful crystal this crystal usually is used to activate your chakras this crystal is usually used to bring about some kind of a balance in your life it helps in any kind of a, a medical issue like throat it's associated with throat it's associated with the nose ears and eyes it's also associated with the brain but um, I feel like today this crystal is coming up because it just wants to remind you that things are going to go uh, beautiful for you guys and you just don't have to worry if this crystal will bring you inner peace it will bring you that confidence it will give you some kind of a deeper understanding of everything and this is a crystal that uh, represents a very very beautiful peaceful relationship is um what i see here with these cards okay that is what i can see here guys and if you guys uh, feel like this is the crystal for you if you are not having inner peace and everything this is a great crystal to have especially for those of you who are trying to open up your third eye and stuff this crystal is very useful for that it will help you balance out your energies or who are having a lot of throat pain eye pain and the nose pain this crystal is really good for that guys and also the color associated with this crystal is the sky blue again so you can use sky blue color today to get rid of any kind of negativity this crystal will give you the same effect as this stone okay let us see what is coming up for those of you who chose the card card so we have the aquamarine now this is also one of the most 
beautiful crystals guys i just love aquamarine so much like i have a lot of aquamarine crystals but not here with me it's in the other room and i will once show you this crystal so this crystal is closely connected to a lot of love it's connected to a lot of commitment this is also a crystal that needs to be cleansed every day in case you're owning an aquamarine okay so this stone is a very very beneficial for anybody who's been through any kind of a traumatic experience <clears throat> any kind of a past uh, life experience or a traumatic experience that happened in this life that you are not happy about or something is bad is happening this crystal will really help you relieve it guys any kind of an emotional trauma or uh, anything a conflict or any kind of a stress this crystal will really help you suppress all of these emotions and help you lead yourself into the path of peace in in case if you guys are suffering from all of these situations and this crystal can also be used if you are having any kind of um, um, health issue like that is regarding to your throat or your lungs okay this crystal will really help you through all that and yes guys also thank you all so much for joining me here my lovely beautiful souls and i will see you guys tomorrow like comment and subscribe if this reading resonates also if you want to book a personal reading with me all the details are down in the description bye guys